How would you be able to solve for x when you're given an x squared and an x value? Well, we could use something called diamond method to help solve this out. We'll put the number at the end here. I'll we'll put this negative seven down here. We're trying to figure out a number that we multiply to 12, but we're gonna to add to negative seven. Well, those two numbers are gonna be minus three and minus four. Now we can rewrite our equation now in terms of parentheses. Well, we'll have our two values of x on the left side, and then we'll put our minus three and our minus four that we gathered from our diamond method. Now again, this is gonna be equal to zero. And if that's the case, we're actually gonna have two different answers. We'll have an x minus three equals zero, and an x minus four is equal to zero. We can add three on both sides for this one, add a four on both sides for this one, and that's gonna give us that x is equal to three, and x is equal to four. And these would be our two answers.